All right, hi everybody. It's Bonkai Nine Twenty Two. Um, <clears throat> the Kanichi chapter review, um, will be done tomorrow. Um, see what happened was I got whammed by two shows. Two chapters came out for two shows that I review. Um, Kanichi, and what I heard about Kanichi was next week chapter. Is not gonna be for me. It's not coming out. Next week's gonna be on a break. So, all on that. Um, something else came out today. The other day. <sighs> Attack on Titan. Ooh, boy. Chapter 30. Um, this one was entitled The Defeated. Oh, man. This one was a crazy one. Um, basically. <clears throat> I found out the name of that guy, the, um, the guy who took in Aaron, uh, for his, for the scout, for his, 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 his group, for the, ar the army, you know, uh, his name's Corporal Rivalis. I hope I'm saying that right. Rivalis, Rivalis. Um, and he, you you, you I'll talk about him in this chapter review because basically what happened in this chapter. Do you want to notice about this show? Very little talking. Very little talking. And I mean it. It's like half through this chapter, it's nothing but action. And basically, it starts off with Aaron, not Aaron, talking about Miss Mikaska. Miss Mikasa. I can't even say this girl's name. Mikaska, Mikaska, his stepsister, um, is chasing the female type of John, uh, Titan, and she says, "Give me Aaron back!" Blah blah blah. She's running after him, and that's when Rivalis, Corporal, Corporal Rivalis, notices what she's doing, and she's asking Miska, um, you know, stops her, and will fall back. She tells him, and uh. And they're having a little small talk here and there about, oh, you're, you're Aaron's friend, you know, he's alive, sir, and so on and so forth. And basically, they go in, not to kill the giant, not to kill the female titan, just to rescue Aaron. So they're going through, and it's a really crazy thing going on. And they're trying to get him back, you know, and, you know, uh, Valleys is telling her, go this way, you know, distract her, and I'll go this way. And then they, they do what they're supposed to do. At one point, the Titan almost kills Mikaska. 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 Mik. My. Mik. My. Ah, I don't know to say her name. Mikaska. Almost. But then Valleys stops the hand, and he's able to cut her, cut the Titan's jaw off. And Aaron falls out, and they grab him, and they leave. When they're escaping, Rivalis looks back. The female Titan is crying. I already went on this the site. Um, what's the name of the site? I forgot the name of the site. Um, the site that has the manga. Uh, of uh, Attack on Titan, uh, mangafox.com, and <clears throat> I was looking at the forums, and a lot of people disagree in saying that it's Aaron's mother. Who else is it? That's my thing. But anyway, going on. Then after that occurs, they take Aaron and they go back to the town to the, to back to where they were, and. You know, after the whole situation, Aaron wakes up. He's like, "Oh, what happened? What happened?" She says, "Oh, rest, Aaron. Rest, Aaron. What happened to the female Titan?" You know, so and so forth. And as they're going back, they notice the town people are saying, "Oh, they had so many people that were so gung ho to go in there, and now look how it happened." And Aaron's really upset. And then you see these two kids on top of this ladder looking into the scouts, and they're like, "And Mikuska." And Aaron are having like a flashback of when they were there. And then there's another scene also with um, a father of this girl going to um, Rivalis, Cor Corporal Rivalis. And um, 
asking where she is and stuff, and you can see the dread on everyone's faces. That's why this obviously this chapter was called the Defeated. And um, there's this little inset, and 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 they're asking Commander Irvin, "Oh, what happened? You know, do, 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 the mission, you know, so and so forth. How can you fail with the mission, so and so forth?" And then what happens is, at the last page, you get this in this little thing. And saying Commander Irvin did not, he had to explain. Oh, actually, you know what? Let me read it to you guys. Uh, it was done. This came out yesterday. <laughs> I am, you know, it came out right yesterday. So, 42. Okay. The blow dealt by the exp the expe the expedition, both monetary and human resources wise, was so costly that it was enough to, for the supporters and the scanning unit legion to m turn away from it. And then it says, Irvin was held responsible and summoned to the imperial capital, while Urn was to be handed over to the authorities. So it was obviously a waste of time, waste of money, waste of man me 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 manpower. Until the chapter ends. This is getting really good. I, I'm gonna give this um this show this this manga has got me on the edge of my seat because I'm thinking okay whoever this female titan is it's gotta be somebody close to Aaron. Who is it? It's gotta be his mother. I, I'm totally flabbergasted with it. As far as rating is concerned, um, not a whole lot happened. They just rescued Aaron and went back to the town, to the you know village. Um, hmm. I give this a three and a half out of five. I still want to see more. I still want to see more out of Attack on Titan. And this thing's a monthly, so it should try to. Uh, and fix myself here. Sorry, excuse me. Um, it should try to at least give us some more details. The only thing so far that I think this chapter illustrates is that this female titan it's somebody that cares for Aaron. Because it was crying. It's draw was gone and it's there's a tear coming down its eye. Now, there's nobody who could be that Titan except for his mother. I I'm convinced. It has to be his mother. Who else is it? I mean, this show is very good, and I'm really excited for it. Chapter chapter 30 was, was I mean, chapter 29 was him fighting that thing. And then he loses, and then he gets, you know. And when they pulled him out of the jaw... You saw him fall out, so that Titan was smart. He, she was just basically holding him in his mouth, in his, in her mouth, and was gonna run to wherever she was going. It was very strange, but this is what I have to gather now. This is a monthly, so it's like I fucking hate this shit. A monthly, I just gotta wait. Now it's like this one came out um yesterday. Um let's see. <laughs> Sorry, making weird sound effects. Um yeah, yesterday. And it came out yesterday and the one before that, it came out January 12th. So that means it's coming out more or less within the same area. Early in the month. So that's good. But I'm just like, I'm wondering when are they going to get to the good stuff, you know? This is like, it's a monthly. It should really get really... But this was really just them rescuing Aaron. That was really... And they just come home and they just feel like... It's the defeated. You know? 
But I want to hear what you guys think. Comments below. You know the story. Rate, tell, subscribe. The only person who's really excited with this besides me is Kosein and one of my subscribers. No, I want to hear what people think about this show. No one is reviewed. You know, I'm just like, no one is reviewed. You know, it, it makes me wonder. How can you not like this show? Not review it. <clears throat> it's beyond comprehension to me that nobody is reading this manga. Nobody. Oh, I'm, I'm not going to say reading. I'm just saying no one's reviewing it. Am I the only person in the YouTube anime fucking community who is reviewing this show? Can, give me exa Give me a reason why I'm the only person. Like, it's a great show. Phone. Uber Black Man. I'm just naming these names because they're not They're not reviewing it. They're doing stupid shit. Like, oh, um, One Piece. Uh, all right, fine. That's something that. But they give this show a chance. Review it. Take a look at it. Boom. Come on. Everybody else, too, in, the, in this anime community. You, everyone needs to start reviewing this show. Attack on Titan. I know it's a monthly. I know it's aggravating. But read the chapters and look at it. You're going to like it. This is a good show. Good shonen series. Said it. It's a good shonen. It really is. So, um, I never, you know, it's violent. All right, it's violent. Fine. But still, check it out. But this chapter, like I said before, three and a half out of five, we got to get more details on this story. We got to get more details on the female type. I, I, I have to say, it's got to be his mother. <coughs> Excuse me. Pepsi. I can't see how it can be anybody else but his mother. Um. So yeah, that's the story. But three and a half out of five. I want to see more. Um, won't be happening until March, so I'll have very tell by then. Part four. And I'll review the next chapter of it. But this was this. The fact that that Titan was crying can tell you can tell that it's got some connection with there. So yeah, good chapter. It was good. It could have been a little bit better, but like I said, we're we're seeing some things here. Now we are seeing some things happening in this show that are referring to us that that we're that you know are saying that there's more to this situation that meets the eye. You know, Transformers, for the least odd. Anyway, it's Bankai 22, Attack on Titan. I will get to Kenichi. Not tonight. Not tonight. I will do it tomorrow night. Along with... What else? Oh, yeah. Kenichi and... I mean, see. So do those two... Tomorrow night, okay? See you guys later.